Hi, I'm Mitch Gallagher. Welcome to Sweetwater's Guitars and Gear. This time out, a great solution for direct injecting your signal from your pedal board or your amplifier into a recorder or a live sound system. Let's get started. Today we're checking out the Two Notes Torpedo Cab M. That's this pedal size box that's sitting on top of the amplifier next to me. The Torpedo Cab M makes a great addition to your arsenal because it allows you to route the signal from your amplifier or your pedal board straight into an audio interface or a mixer. Great for the studio and great for live sound applications. The Torpedo Cab M uses impulse response technology to achieve this. Basically, you measure a speaker, you input that digital data into the Torpedo Cab M, or you use some of the preloaded IRs that come with it or you download from the web. There's lots of different sources for impulse responses. And then that actual speaker response is applied to the signal that you're routing into the box. So we route out of the speaker output of the amplifier into the Torpedo Cab M. Then we take another cable and route from the Torpedo Cab M and into our speaker. This is not a load box, so you always have to have a speaker connected when you're using an amplifier. The signal comes in and it's processed using power amp simulation, four different types of tubes, two different types of amps. A variety of different speaker responses. As I said, there are 32 that come preloaded, and you can add many, many more as you like. Then you can apply EQ, room reverb, and two different microphones simultaneously. You have eight different microphone choices, and you can position two of those exactly the way that you want them. All this comes together to recreate the effect of putting a real microphone on the amplifier. It gives you a very authentic result. What you heard during the intro to this video was this Fender Deluxe routed through the Two Notes Cab M, and then being sent straight into our recorders. Now there's also a second way we can use the Torpedo Cab M. We can actually use it on our pedal board. So you can route your pedals, your distortion boxes, your overdrives, your delays, choruses, whatever you want, straight into the Torpedo Cab M and then send that signal out into your recorder or your live sound console. <laughs> So what you're hearing is a Tumnus Deluxe Overdrive coming through a Boss DD500 delay and a Strymon Blue Sky Reverb. That's all that's feeding into the Torpedo Cab M. Then the power amp simulation, the speaker emulation, the microphones and so on are coming from the pedal and being controlled in this case by my laptop. The Torpedo Cab M can be operated in three different ways. First of all, you can use the front panel. We access the menu by clicking this button. You can scroll through the different choices, select the one you want to work on and then we can scroll through the different parameters and adjust them. The second way we can control the Torpedo Cab M is using a mobile device. I have the Torpedo Remote app loaded here on my iPad. Your mobile device connects to the Torpedo Cab M using Bluetooth. When you install the app, you now have access to the power amplifier here on top, the different types of tubes, etc. Equalization, there are three different types of equalizers you can use, guitar, bass, or custom, which is a semi-parametric EQ. Then we have reverb, which can simulate rooms, cathedrals, studios, and so on. Then down here at the bottom is where we control the two different microphones. We can set the distance from the speaker, as well as the orientation left-right in front of the speaker, so we can adjust the axis as well. We have eight different types of microphones we can choose from, ribbons, condensers, dynamic mics, and you can see the placement of those, as well as the cabinet they've selected here in the lower left. In this section of the screen, we can also choose among the different cabinet IRs that we have loaded inside of the Torpedo Cab M. We've got 32 cabinets in there, 1x12s, 2x12s, 4x12s, and even some base cabinets. So it's very easy to navigate. You can see exactly what's happening inside the compact box. So that's our second way of controlling the Torpedo Cab M. Moving over to the MacBook, we have an app that's very similar to what we saw with the mobile device. Again, we can access our presets here just like we could with the mobile device or from the front panel of the box itself. We can choose two different modes. Simulation allows us to see the room and how the microphone is placed on the amp. Arcade mode, in this case, as we're making a change to a control, we're moving multiple parameters simultaneously, so it's a little quicker, a little more intuitive to work with. 
We also have an IR loader here for loading in third-party IRs or if you create your own impulse responses. Cabinet manager, you can see our 32 cabinets that are loaded here inside the box. A preset manager where we can store all our user presets and factory presets and so on. So we have a lot of control here in the app for taking charge of what's happening inside the pedal. That's our third way to operate the unit. And again, what's happening here is we're coming straight out of the pedal board and then into the Torpedo Cab M. And it's given us a great tone, just like we're plugged into an amplifier. We can actually choose to push the power amplifier enough to send it into a bit of saturation, so we can add some distortion from that point as well. Very realistic. I hope you enjoyed this look at the Tunos Torpedo Cab M. This is a great solution. Plug your amplifier into it, plug your pedal board into it, however you want to use it, it makes a great solution in the studio or live. For silent practice, you'll need to add a load box to this, and of course there is one from Two Notes that you'll want to check out. This is not a load box, you always have to have a speaker connected to it if you're using an amplifier. When we're using a pedal board, we don't have to have a speaker involved. But however you're using the Torpedo Cab M, the result is you're going to get great sound out of it. It's in a super compact, lightweight, and very convenient form factor. Definitely check it out for your pedal board. Thanks for joining me for Sweetwater's Guitars and Gear. Be sure to tune in next time. We'll have more guitars, more amps, more effects. We'll be making lots of music. I'm Mitch Gallagher. Mm -hmm.